welcome to digital learning platform of Shri Guru Sudhendra College, course BCA, subject mathematics and the topic is ellipse. So we know that the general equation of the ellipse is, is x square divided by a square plus y square divided by b square equals to 1. The case is a greater than b. So this is the ellipse. Here c is the center, s and s dash are the foci, l, l dash, l1, l1 dash are the Lattice rectum of the ellipse. So see having the coordinates 0, 0. In this case that is a greater than b. So x axis is the major axis. Y axis is the minor axis. So length of this major axis is 2a. And length of minor axis is 2b. In the same way length of semi major axis is a. And length of semi minor axis is b. Next is the eccentricity. The eccentricity of the ellipse is given by e square equals to 1 minus b square divided by a square. So this is the formula to find the eccentricity. S and S dash are the foci. So having the coordinates a e comma 0 and minus a e comma 0. So these two are the foci of the ellipse. Then length of lattice rectum is given by the formula 2b square divided by a. So this is the formula to find the length of lattice rectum that is 2b square divided by a. Take on problem. Find the lattice rectum of the ellipse 4x square plus 9y square equals to 36. So the given equation of the ellipse is 4x square plus 9y square equals to 36. So we know that the general equation is x square uh, divided by a square plus y square divided by b square equals to 1. So that means RHS must be 1. So divide the given equation throughout by 36. We get 4x square divided by 36 plus 9y square divided by 36 equals to 36 divided by 36. Which implies x square divided by 9 plus y square divided by 4 equals to 1. So compare this equation with the general equation we get a square equals to 9 and b square equals to 4. So that means a equals to 3 and b equals to 2. So we have to find the length of lattice rectum. In this case a is greater than b that is 3 is greater than so the length of lattice rectum is given by the formula 2b square divided by a. So b square is 4, a is 3. So 2 into 4 divided by 3 that is 8 divided by 3. So length of lattice rectum is 8 divided by 3. Take one more problem. Find the length of major and minor axis, length of lattice rectum, eccentricity and coordinates of the foci of the ellipse x square divided by 25 plus y square divided by 9 equals to 1. So the given equation is x square divided by 25 plus 9 y square divided by 9 equals to 1. So compare this equation with the general equation we get a square equals to 25 and b square equals to 9. That means a equals to 5 and b equals to 3. So 5 is greater than 3. That is a is greater than b. So length of this major axis is 2a. So 2 into 5 that is 10. And length of minor axis, minor, minor axis is 2b. So 2 into 3 that is 6. So length of lattice rectum. So length of lattice rectum is given by the formula 2b square divided by a. So 2 into 9 divided by 5. So that is 18 divided by 5. Next is eccentricity. The eccentricity of the ellipse is given by e square equals to 1 minus b square divided by a square. So e square equals to 1 minus 9 divided by 25. That is 25 minus 9 divided by 25. That is e square equals to 16 divided by 25. So, E is 4 divided by 5. 
Next thing is to find the coordinates of the foci. That is a comma zero. So s having the coordinates a comma zero. So a is five and e is four divided by five. So five five getting cancelled. Four comma zero. And s dash having the coordinates minus e comma zero. So minus five into four divided by five comma zero. That is minus four comma zero. So four comma zero and minus four comma zero are the foci of the given ellipse. Thank you.